hello there so I have already set up my base I have got my um, placemat on my spinner and I have already coated it with the paint dripping leftovers from my previous pour which was a mix of autumn colors and extreme sheen 24 um, carat gold which of course is a very very bright color so on this I am going to place a open cup which I've just roughly chopped the top off it's a um, shot cup and I'm going to move it around the board uh, adding paint the colors are also from my last pour which were black extreme sheen pearl metallic orange extreme sheen gold lime green and yellow deep so I'll get started now <laughs> That is pretty. I have got some beautiful colours in there. Again, the autumn tones I was looking for because here in New Zealand, of course, we are in autumn. Our leaves are starting to go the beautiful 
golden red and brown colours that they do as they're dying and those are the sorts of colours that I was looking for here. Now I have got silicone in there and I am going to use my torch but before I do I will tell you that I really like this just as it is. Um, so I'm a little bit worried about over putting too many cells on it but I do have bubbles to get out so I will go what I call cell hunting now. Just in pockets I think. See what I can get. Get rid of a few of the bubbles. Just so pretty. I have got one or two little cells but mostly it's either bubbles or lacing from the silicone and I think that'll do it. That is plenty more than enough. So now I will bring it up into the light and show you. The yellow has held its own, the green has held its own and along with the orange but still the gold I believe is more predominant even through the black. But that is just so pretty and for me so autumny. Normally I scrape the paint off these uh, placemats when I've finished with them because I'm just using them to try out new ideas and to practice. But this one I am going to allow to dry because it is just so pretty. I can put a wall mount for uh, for plate ha a plate hanger one onto the back of it when it's dry and then hang it on my wall and the autumn colours. That, that is just the most beautiful time of year for me. So that's it for this video. Thank you very much for joining me and I'll see you next time.